hello guys here is shivli and you are welcome to my kitchen today i am going to show you how to make vegetable noodle soup it's a very easy and simple recipe and very delicious to eat eat or drink as you say it it's super yummy so let's see the recipe here you can see friends that i have taken some cabbage finely chopped some carrots finely chopped two green chilies finely chopped some green peas you may take any kind of veggies there is no problem according to your choice i have taken some fresh coriander leaves and some spring onion for garnishing and here i have taken one packet of yeppi noodles with the masala you may take maggi yeppi or any kind of noodles as you like so let's go for the main process at first i'm adding a little cooking oil into the saucepan i have taken at first i'm going to fry the green peas in the oil because i've taken fully fresh green peas so they'll take a longer time to be cooked we have to fry the peas until they are cooked fully 100% and now they are 100% cooked if you can't understand you may eat a pea to check and now we have to add the rest of the veggies the carrots the cabbage you may change the quantity of veggies there is no problem according to your wish i'm adding a little salt the noodles masala also contains salt so don't add so much salt at the beginning now we have to stir fry the veggies for 3 to 4 minutes on high heat i'm adding the green chilies along with the veggies and waiting for 3 to 4 minutes on high heat and we have to stir the veggies continuously like this After three to four minutes, we have to add water here. We need to add a big quantity of water because we are going to add some noodles. After adding water, we will stir a little, and now we have to add the masala. I mean the noodles masala, yeppi masala here. The spices mixture of the noodles. and at the same time we have to add half teaspoon of black pepper powder if you are adding normal noodles i mean hakka noodles then there is no need of adding noodles masala you may skip it there is no problem i have added half teaspoon of black pepper powder now i am mixing very nicely now we have to bring the soup to a boil so the heat should be on high and now the soup is boiling nicely now we have to add the noodles into the soup after adding noodles we have to cook it for 5 minutes only or until the noodles is boiled 100% so let's wait for some time about 5 to 6 minutes while the soup is boiling we have to make a slurry of corn flour to make the soup thicker I have taken half tablespoon of corn flour into a bowl and I have added some water into it. I'm mixing it nicely to make it lumps free. Now let's keep it aside and about 4 to 5 minutes are gone. Let's check the noodles. It's cooked fully as you can see. So now it's time to add the corn flour slurry. So I'm mixing the slurry nicely again, and now I'm adding the slurry into the soup. We have to stir the soup while adding the corn flour slurry like this to avoid lumps. So now I'm mixing nicely. So now, as you can notice, that the soup is thicker than before. So at the end of this recipe, we have to garnish the soup with some spring onion and some fresh coriander leaves. So I'm adding some spring onion. and some fresh coriander leaves after adding the coriander leaves and spring onion we have to cook for about 1 minute on high heat and then our soup is ready and before turning the heat off must check the salt i also checked it and i need some more salt so i'm adding some salt again mixing nicely and our soup is ready So let's turn the heat off and serve our vegetable noodle soup hot.
you have seen friends the recipe is very easy and it's very delicious to eat and drink so try this simple recipe at home and don't forget to let me know about your experience hit the like button friends if you really liked the video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel hope to meet you in the next video thank you so much for watching bye bye take care